going on everybody it's dp here with the bet on me podcast it's thursday april 27th 2023 hey i'm just happy to be alive i'm happy to be back on sports yesterday was a shit show for me uh oh and five the big donut you know uh it happens sometimes we'll go ahead I'll go ahead, you know, because I'm not I'm not trying to act like I'm somebody I'm not, you know, because, you know, everybody doesn't win all the time. You know, for as many parlays as I hit, you're going to have days like this. Check this out. Look at this. Forty six and fifty five cent of forty six percent. You know, not a good ratio right here. Minus nine hundred forty one dollars. But, you know, it is what it is. We'll get back up there. Return on investment minus nine point thirty two guys. Just being fully transparent, as you can see, we got um like nine picks going on today here. Uh, but this is where I go to make all my picks and keep track of all my stuff. Capitech.com. We'll leave the link down below in the description. You can come sign up yourself. Uh, jump on this leaderboard directory over here and find, you know, all the you know, the better cappers than me right now. And uh all the stuff over here, the game trends, the trend finder, the game simulator, the news aggregator, they got all the podcasts. My podcast is on here on the Game Cap Census channel. You can go over there and check out the Bet on Me podcast streaming every day. We upload uh a new episode of the podcast every time uh the newest episode is uploaded and the old episode is always on uh the Game Cap Census channel for you to check out as well as the YouTube. Links are down below in the description. Anyway, guys. Capper Tech over here. I'm I'm dying. I'm dying right now. Uh, this is where I keep up with everything when I talk about you know the Capper Tech website. This is this is this is all the stuff that I'm doing right here. And as you can see, just Seattle Mariners right here. Yesterday, absolute shit show. Uh, the New York Mets. Oh, how you doing? That's a fucking loss. Uh, we've got the Marlins over here taking on the Braves. Yeah, why in the hell? that I think it was a good idea to bet against the fucking Braves. Like, can anybody explain this shit? To me? I don't know what the fuck's going on. The Cubs over here against the Padres. Now, I got to tell you, I'm a little disappointed in that. I thought the Cubs would actually get it done. The Padres just come out of fucking nowhere. And, you know, they start doing that Slam Diego bullshit. And it's just, it's all over with. And St. Louis Cardinals, um, you know, they just shit the fucking bet. I, I don't really know how else to to describe that or you know say it or just you know whatever whatever there is to say about it but i thought the cardinals were going to get it done against the giants because i think the giants are trash but you can see my you know my percentage is 46 percent right now so who the hell is going to listen to me right anyway we've got the uh, we're going to talk about some uh nfl draft today because the draft is on tonight and if you want the rest of the picks for uh, the MLB and the NHL. I got a three leg parlay on the NHL. I've got a few. I got a few parlays out, guys and gals, over on the Discord. You go check it out. Telegram's still running somewhere if you want to go look at that. But the Discord's where you can get everything, or the Instagram or the Twitter. Uh, links are going to be down below in the description. Make sure you follow us at Bet On Me Pod. Uh, that's somewhere right here, somewhere right over here, somewhere. It's like right there. I think is where that little thing is. Uh, at Bet underscore on underscore me underscore pod and that is our twitter handle i know it's a lot but you know there you go if you want to go get the pics that we share on there we also have a tiktok it's all the bet on me podcast you just look that shit up and you will find it um sorry if i'm cursing too much for you but i feel like uh i watch a lot of these guys do these pick videos and stuff and everyone just seems so buttoned up and just so trying to be professional and shit you know there's nothing professional about this. This is gambling. I, you know, I mean, I don't, we, we can wear a nice suit if we want to, but at the end of the day, we're still throwing money and losing money. So light a cigar, crack open a bottle and uh, watch the fucking horses run around the track. Right. Anyway, let's figure out what we're doing now. Uh, looking at this stuff right here. Bryce Young is, um, he's minus 5,000 to go uh, to the uh the panthers so i think that's a pretty done deal right there i think bryce young going to the panthers is a pretty done deal number one minus five thousand uh in the sports books right now over on fanduel sportsbook i mean it that's insane uh a lot of guys are looking at will anderson a lot of guys are looking at tyree wilson uh will leave us uh he is someone that is looked at that could go number two to the texans and i know that um i know that uh the Colts need a quarterback, but uh, I, I don't. I, I think I, I don't know. I think Stroud. I don't. 
I think someone might move up. Perhaps, you know, the Colts could possibly move up and try to take um, Stroud. I, I just don't – I don't think Stroud's going to be on the board very long. I think uh, Will Levis probably goes to the Texans or Stroud goes to the Texans. But I, I have a strong feeling that Stroud – it's either Stroud or Levis going to go number two. Uh, if – if the Cardinals don't move up to number three, I'm thinking that Stroud goes number four to the Colts because Levis will be taken at number two by the Texans. Um, I, I don't know. I don't know. You know, I just I just know the Texans need a quarterback, and I know that uh, the Colts need a whole new damn team, so they're needing somebody they can rebuild around and. Um, yeah, so we're going with Stroud, sprinkle a little bit on there, and we're going with Levis from Kentucky. Stroud, of course, from Ohio State. Uh, yeah, it's going to be an interesting night. I think I think Bryce Young, I don't know if he's necessarily the number one pick in the draft. I don't know if he's the best quarterback, uh, mainly because Alabama having, you know, most of their players go throughout the entire draft, you know, O-line, D-line, Defend. Like when I think of Alabama, I think the whole team, you know, all the players are good. Everybody on the team can dominate. Uh, the quarterback is just a guy who kind of goes out there and kind of manages and, you know, maybe throws a deep ass bomb, you know, the last minute of the game to win a championship. Sometimes that should happen. But for the most part, Alabama has all around good defense, offense, offensive line, you know, star players on you know, offense and defense and the key positions you want them, cornerbacks, safeties, all those guys make really big plays as opposed to like an Ohio State where it's, you know, the quarterback's the show, the running back's the show. You got like a wide receiver and you got a couple guys on defense, uh, a cornerback and a middle linebacker that really, you know, make things happen. So I really think I really think when it comes down to it, I think uh, I think Stroud's a better quarterback than Bryce Young. I really do. I didn't see anything from from Bryce Young. Uh, hell, I don't even know if it goes number one. Hell, could Stroud go to number one? No, let's not, let's not do all that. Uh, anyway, I think it'd be a good, I think it'd be a good idea to take uh, for the number two pick right here on the odds. We've got the number two and three pick. I think it'd be a good idea to take, um, you know, Stroud on the number two pick, and uh, with the number three pick, it'd probably be Levis, number four pick. Yeah, see, Stroud, Stroud, he could go number – he's plus 270 to go number four. I think he goes number four, and, and I think Levis goes number two. But I've already sprinkled a little bit on Stroud to go number two. <laughs> Stroud to go number two. And um, I'm going to go ahead and look at this right here to tell you guys because it's looking like right now the number two overall pick um, – Because I've got him to go number two. I have Stroud to go number two. And it's at plus 450 right now. And, yeah, it was plus 900 like 30 minutes ago. And now it's plus 450. C.J. Stroud's going number two. It's either him or Will Leeds. So, wow. Anyway... I think uh, that's that's what we're taking. We're taking Stroud, with the number two pick, going to the Texans. I think they need a quarterback. I think they need a superstar quarterback. While I think Levis at Kentucky would be decent for the job, I think that uh, I think that they need somebody that can come down there and make an instant change, and that's C.J. Stroud. Uh, we got picks going on. Like I said, we got parlays. We got the NFL going. The NFL draft. Uh, we've got that tonight with the pick CJ Stroud going number two. We have uh, a couple parlays, three leg parlay in the NHL. We've got some uh, lotto parlays uh, in MLB. I know we got a four leg parlay MLB baseball that you want to take a look at over on the Discord uh, shared. You guys can follow us over on the Instagram, over on the Twitter, over on the Discord, and get all the picks. We also have the TikTok. Uh, yeah, it's going to be a great night watching the NFL draft. 
Can't wait to get things started. We got some baseball about to kick off here very, very soon. So make sure you get over there and you get those plays. Uh, make sure you go check out Capra Tech. The link is down below in the description. You can keep up with all our plays and sign up to keep up with all your plays and your winning percentage. That way you can't, you know, the, you got to be transparent with what you're doing. You got to be real about this. If you're not winning money, you can't say you are. I mean, you can, but you're a fake influencer at that point. Shout out to the at 5 Bet Apparel, at the 5 Bet Apparel. Hooking us up with the koozie over here so we can watch, you know, watch the games, drink the beers, got the hats, got all the shirts. These guys hooked us up with so much shit. Got to absolutely love them. Got to shout them out here on the podcast. So that's it for today. You want any more of the picks? Like I said, head over to the Discord, check them out. But we're taking CJ Stroud number two tonight. That's that's just how we're rolling tonight on the uh, on the NFL draft. So good luck to everyone who's got their picks. And yeah, let's go get those bets in. Let's go watch some MLB until then. <laughs>